Hey guys, what is up? It is McDeegs, and welcome back to another Feed the Beast series. Um, series, I mean episode. Um, <laughs> so yeah, as you can see, I've added an addition to my house, or I've kind of added like a whole new house actually, because this part is actually going to be my house up there. It's going to be kind of like my power room. So um, I kind of just added like a whole new section to my house, and I did some interior work. As you can see, it looks pretty nice. That's redwood planks right up there. And over here, I got, whoa, one of them must have died. I got my sheep for the red wool on the floor and, whoops. And um, got my chest over here. Nothing's over here. This is where all my machines are gonna go. Hopefully it fits. Um, that's what she said. And um, over here, well, let me show you down here first. Down here is going to be my storage area my future storage area these chests are just kind of gonna be like uh chests just for like junk chests i guess you can call it just for like stuff that i don't feel like organizing and over here is my way up to the upper house so anyway i want to start working on some uh some machines and uh i guess the first machine that you really have to make when you're playing feed the bees is a generator and damn sheep let me just turn the volume all the way down for now um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, the first machine that you really have to make is a generator, um, just because it, um, you know, it gives you power. It's an easy way of getting power with coal and I have plenty of coal right now. And, um, I think it would just be the best way. So, and uh, let's, let's see how to make this and sorry about that. Um, so a generator and whoops, typed R. Okay. Generator. Um, okay, so we're gonna need an RE battery or fine iron and an iron furnace and let's do it this way This way seems easier. So for a machine block you're gonna need eight refined iron a furnace Everybody knows how to make a furnace and an RE battery. How do you make an RE battery? Oh, it doesn't show me. Oh Let's show it up here. Let's try to look it up RE It doesn't even come up here. All right so I gotta go look it up on the wiki right, real quick. I'll be right back. All right, so you're gonna need 10 redstone and a copper cable. And I believe I have a copper cable. What's going on here? Why is it? Okay, there we go. So we need 10, we need refined iron. Do we have 10, 10, 10, 10? Yes, we have plenty of tin. Um, so we have to go smelt that. And where's my, oh yeah, I put all the all this stuff over here. So let's, um, do I have a crafting table? Oh, it's upstairs. I forgot. Okay, so we got to make a crafting table as well. Like that. So, let's put that there. And sorry if you can hear my mouse clicking in the background. Uh, this mic is super sensitive and I need to play around with the settings a little bit longer. So, we need some tin. Um, and we're going to need some redstone and some copper cable so i have copper but i do not have any um rubber yet so it's time to um plant our rubber tree here i don't have any bones though so it's really no point we can go find some rubber trees so let's go make a tree tap if you don't know what a tree tap is well i don't know why i keep on saying that when people don't know what things are but um a tree tap and that is not I think you need one more piece of wood. Um, tree tap will help us collect some stuff, um, some sticky resin. So you can use it on trees. So let's see how to make this. All right, so, okay, I like that. Okay, I almost got it. So one on top, dun, dun, dun. there we go, tree tap. All right, let's go find us. A rubber tree. I think there's one in the distance there. I can already kind of see it. Yep, there it is. All right, let's go get it. Okay, we're here at the rubber trees. And um, just in case, a little tip to you guys. Um, one way to know a rubber tree is a rubber tree is that the leaves stay... Um, what's the word? They stay see-through, even though um, you have it on fast. And I'm actually running it on fast right now when I record because this game has so many mods in it that it actually slightly makes me lag. Um, so, come on. We need one more piece. We need six pieces of rubber. 
Oh my god, there's no rubber here. That's not good. Um, <laughs> crap. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, there's one here. Okay, this tree might be the savior. Come on, please tell me you got something for me. Come if this doesn't have any rubber. There we go. Alright, might as well look around for some more. So many leaves. Alright. Yep, okay, whatever. We got we got uh six. Yep, perfect. Okay. Um so we're gonna need six in order to make some copper cable, and we'll get six uh strands of copper cable out of it, I'm pretty sure. Not a hundred percent, but I'm pretty sure. Alright, so let's uh go ahead and take the tin out. I will make one more just to make it twenty, because I like having stuff even. Um, so you put the sticky resin in there and it will make rubber. So we got to wait for the rubber to be done. I already got the copper in my inventory. So we got to wait for the rubber to be done smelting and I will get back to you guys. And there we go. We got five pieces of rubber and no, I was not just standing there um, watching it. I actually organized my chest a little bit. So, um, with the inventory tweaks mod so copper cable and the way you make it is you put the copper cable on top this is how to make an re battery and you put the tin in the middle at least this is how i how i, I looked it up on the tech it wiki hopefully it's the same okay oh no it's the redstone in the middle okay i got scared there um <laughs> i was like no don't make me look like an idiot there we go i looked it up on the tech it wiki actually um but it's the same because it's the same mod, industrial craft or whatever it's called. So just finish off smelting that. Um, and then for the generator. So let's go back. Generator. Um, there we go. So to make. Okay, so we're good. Now we just need to make the machine block and the furnace. So we're going to need some refined iron for a machine block because a machine block is made I think like that yep there we go okay now I just need a furnace and we are one more step away from making a generator actually I'm not sure if that's right um no that's not right RE battery goes on top can we actually put this in any way no we can't it has to be on top oh that's cool can we put it in the middle row Yes, we can. All right. <laughs> I just want to test that. So generator. There we go. We can put some coal in it and it will generate electricity or whatever um, it's called. I forgot what they call it. So will it actually store in here? I'm not sure because I'm not sure if we're going to need to make a bat box. Um, I'll show you guys a bat box really quick. I might as well make it. Or what's the thing after a bat box? There's a bat box. Is there, there's different levels of um, what is this? It looks like a face whatever um <laughs> so there's different levels there's a bat box there's a i think it's an m f there's an mfe and then there's an mfsu i'm not sure what it stands for don't ask me um definitely not on the level to make an ms okay what did i do definitely not on the level to make a mfsu just yet yeah we're gonna need that makes that you need diamonds for that i'm pretty sure yep there we go okay so not on that level yet uh, let's check out how I make the MFE. Yeah, I'm not on this level either. So that kind of sucks. What are these things? Lithium battery. Oh, it won't show me how to make it, bastards. There we go. Um, all right. <laughs> I have a lot of work to do. So anyway, let's make the bat box because that is the easiest one to make. And I am a noob. So that is good. All right, so we're gonna need copper cable and an RE battery. So we already got the materials in our chest. This goes on the outside. We're gonna need three. So hopefully I have enough. Damn it. Okay. And put one there. Okay. And then one, two, three. And then you need some wood. So let's go ahead and get the wood. And give me that copper cable. All right. So. I'm pretty sure I just looked it up, but I totally forgot already. I think it goes like this. Yep, there we go. Bat box. All right. And we got one copper cable left, which is perfect. 
because we have to connect the bat box to there. So there we go, it's storing energy. That is awesome. It is storing power. Um, I guess the power is measured in this thing right here, EU or slash T. Um, not exactly sure, but anyway, we're, we are making power. <laughs> yes. Um, so I'm pretty sure this is power in here. So if I take this out, I'm pretty sure that will empty and it'll go into here. Um, so now that we got power, we can power different machines. Um, so that's really cool. Um, and I'm actually going to stop the episode here because I want to kind of break it down into steps. The, um, the Feed the Bee series. I want to break, I don't want to just like go off and do random things like I do in my survival. I want to break it down into steps and actually almost have it like a tutorial guide on Feed the Beast. So here we are. Name of this episode, of course, is going to be Power! Um, exclamation point. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, so that's really it for this episode. Um, I'm sorry if it's short. I'm not actually sure how long it is. But uh, yeah, so I guess uh, this is like tutorial number one or something. I don't know. So uh, if you guys don't know how to play this, you know, just follow my series. And every time I upload, you'll learn something new. Um, I won't go off randomly and like show you guys how to make the generator and not and then not how to sh uh, store it. Like I'll, I'll do like a complete like tutorial on like pretty much everything that has to do with that certain subject of that episode. So anyway, thank you guys for watching this. Please thumbs it up if you enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.